Okay. Today we're going to read Open Me, I'm a Dog. This was my favorite book when I was little. It doesn't even have a cover anymore because I read it so much, but the cover used to be just looking like a big dog because the book's a dog. Open Me. I'm a dog. Oh, and it's by Art Spiegelman. I didn't know that. I know that name. <gasps> What's that? You think I smell of paper and ink? You think I look like a book? I was sure you, of all people, could see past the wizard's curse. Look, I can wag my tail. Look at him, he's wagging his tail. How many books have tails that wag? I don't have any others. Listen to this, bow wow. Did you ever hear of a book that could bark? Bark! Wait, don't put me back on the shelf. I'll tell you about the wizard's curse. It started when I was just a pup. They've got a butterfly too. And it's a rabbit in a car. A rabbit drove by, so of course I chased it. I got lost somewhere in an enchanted wood. I was found by a witch. She smelled like oatmeal. I love oatmeal. She was nice for a witch until I chewed up the handle of her very best broom. I didn't mean any harm. I was just a pup and my teeth itched. Try not to be around witches when they get mad. My witch got terribly temper tantrum mad. She said some things I can't repeat and she turned me into a German shepherd. No. Not like that type of German Shepherd. She turned me into a real Ger Shepherd in a mountaintop in Germany. Look, she turned him into a person, but he's thinking about bones still. Then I met Magda, the, the magic maiden of the mountains. She sang like a bird and she smelled like a fish. I liked her and she liked me. So when she asked for a kiss, I howled with joy and licked her face. Just like dogs give kisses. Oh my goodness. Magda thought I was teasing her. She got triple temper tantrum mad. She said some things I won't repeat and she turned me into a bullfrog. Bigger than this one. She turned me into a frog the size of a bull. Look, he's a froggy now but he's still thinking about bones. Magda gave me to her uncle Morris as a gift. He was an evil wizard who wanted to use me in a magic stew. He smelled like cheese and old socks, gross, and his stew smelled way worse. I tried to hide, but it's hard for a giant frog to find really great places to hide. Oh, looks, let's, oh, oh this opens. <gasps> Look at that. He's behind the bookshelf a little bit. And he is hiding all the way up in there. He's a very big frog. He found me and chased me. I knocked over his kettle. Morris got totally temper tantrum mad. Wizards are worse than witches or magic maidens when they get mad. He said some words that I won't ever repeat. And he turned me into this book. But I'm not a shepherd. I'm not a big frog, and I am certainly not a book. I love sitting in your lap, but I want you to pet me, not just turn my pages. Look, they use a different material here, so it's all soft, like felt. I can be your special pal and sneak into school with you, or daycare. I can sleep by your feet and keep you safe while you dream. <gasps> Beware of book. Hey, let's go to the park. We can watch other dogs chase sticks. I may not run as fast as they do, but at least I don't have fleas and I never bite. I love reading books at the park too. If you forget to walk me, I promise not to make a mess on the carpet. Just believe me, I am a dog. I'm a dog, I'm a dog, I'm a dog. And if you let me be your dog, I'll tell you my story whenever you like. The end. I'm pretty sure. I don't think pages are missing. Okay, have a good day.